I just wanted to make a short video talking about the ablateness of the Earth and what a value of 0.3% would actually look like. There are two blue circles on the screen. One of them is a perfect sphere. The other one has a value of 0.3% ablateness applied. Can you tell which is which? What about if I swap them over? Which one is the perfect circle and which one has the ablateness applied? I'll explain that in a moment, but let's just have a look at what 0.3% actually means. It's a very small amount. It's just the same as 3 in 1000. So the ablateness of the Earth basically means that the diameter of the equator is larger than the diameter of the Earth going around the poles, but by only 0.3%. Now, quite often you'll see images like this depicting the ablateness of the Earth. But as you can see, that's very unrealistic because the width far exceeds the, uh, the height from top to bottom. And when you talk about an ablate spheroid, okay, this image is an ablate spheroid, but it's showing the um, shape of the object to be much wider than it is tall. Now, any website that shows the Earth looking like that is really not doing anybody any favours because it's a very unrealistic depiction of what the Earth's ablateness actually looks like. 0.3% is just that much. Now, did you see which one has the ablateness? It's actually the one on the right. This one has the ablateness, circle 2, and circle 1 is the perfect sphere. So, let me just show you how I did that. I'll just close circle 2. We'll close circle one and we'll open it up in a paintbrush program. And we'll just reduce it to a manageable size. And what we need to do here is look at the actual image size in pixels. You'll see the width is 1371 pixels. So if we come down to our calculator and we find 0.3% of that, we go one three seven one times zero point zero zero three now that's uh, the same as zero point three percent because remember one percent is one in a hundred so let's apply that and you'll see that we need to increase the width by four pixels now we won't cheat by going down we will actually round it up to five so we'll increase that to 1376 pixels so it's actually going to have more ablateness than the uh, than the 0.3 percent so let's just apply that and see if you can notice any difference it just got wider very slightly so i'm just going to undo up the top here and then it got narrow again and we're going to redo okay so when i made this uh, original circle with the ablateness, I've saved it as circle two, and I'll link to uh, both of these images in my video so you can compare them for yourself. But uh, let's just not save that. So we've now got the original circle one, which is a perfect sphere, and we've got circle two with the 0.3% ablateness applied. As you can see, it's not that much different when you look at them side by side. and as I said, any website that shows you an image like that and claims that that is what the Earth looks like is really not doing anybody any favours because it's highly distorted and it's not an accurate representation of what 0.3% actually looks like.